I've got 496 minutes until video bloggery goes up. And I just started recording. Okay, Tom, in this video bloggery, three bots. One, a response to your video. Two, excuses about why I don't have a song. And three, I made a new invention that will boggle your mind. Have you ever been in a state of hunger that leaves you half very hungry and half not really wanting to eat. This is a state I find myself in almost all of the time. And so I never know for lunch whether I have one sandwich or two sandwiches. So how can you solve such a predicament? A three-fourth sandwich, a three-fourth sandwich. Everything's better on a three-fourth sandwich. A three-fourth sandwich, a three-fourth sandwich. Lettuce, pickles, tomatoes, ketchup, and mayonnaise. Although none of this stuff is on here. See, the beauty of a three-fourth sandwich is you just need to take three slices of bread and cut one-fourth off of each one and then you will have three sections of bread that are all three-fourths and three one-fourth pieces of bread. Song excuses! So the reason I don't have a song is because it was at home and I just left it in the room for a few minutes and my dog ate it. Excuse number two! So as you might have guessed from the background of this video bloggery, my room is a little bit different, and that is because my standalone closet had a catastrophic failure. This piece, which used to have a big metal pipe holding it up, as you can see, no longer has one. So I had to rearrange my room so that it leaned against the bureau. Well, rearranging my room meant a fun time for me. Unfortunately, it meant I had to take time out of other allotted activities, and you can understand which one lost out. I'm so sorry, cheese whales. Sub what? I don't believe in cheese whales. I've never seen or heard of them. That was photoshopped. Final reason for not having a song done. While I was working on the song, it turned out that it was getting better and better. And as of this point, I see a lot of potential in the song. So instead of finishing it up in one weekend and then posting it online, I thought I'd spend an extra week or two fine-tuning it and getting the lyrics down perfectly. Responses to your video. I'll concede that From Out of the Rain is pretty much a terrible, terrible episode. But come on, every show's gotta have one flop, right? I mean, you don't go around showing Doctor Who to people and then showing them fear her as their first episode. And while you go on to say that the show is severely flawed, you technically make comparisons instead from season one Doctor Who, or excuse me, season 27 or whatever. And then compare it to series two Doctor Who, which I agree is a lot worse. So by transitive property, I think what I was really saying is that Torchwood season two is better than Doctor Who series one and two. And while Doctor Who is interesting, I mean, what do you really get from The Empty Child and The Doctor Dances? Which, by the way, I would consider as one good episode, not two. I mean, I guess you get a sense of satisfaction that the Doctor doesn't always kill everyone he meets. And in Torchwood, there are a number of good episodes. Adrift shows the frailty of the human condition. The first episode takes the key ingredients of a spaghetti western and translates them brilliantly into a science fiction of the 21st century. A Day in the Death gives a science fiction twist to an old philosophical question. And I guess Reset just shows how dumb Martha is. And yeah, Owen kills a whale in me. I guess what I'm trying to say is I don't rescind my position. And yes, I will be watching Torchwood tonight at 9 o'clock if I get this video up by then. Sorry, Tom, but I've got to cut this video short. Feel free to retort and don't forget to tell me whether to buy a Mac or a PC. Right now, I'm leaning more towards a PC. Thanks to the comments from all you helpful viewers. Post your next video up by 11.59 p.m. on Thursday. If you don't, you have to dress up as the guy from Out of the Rain with the big tall hat and then do a video bloggery in public.